Well, let me see what I can do here. This is a Radley hammer drill. Well, drill, hammer drill. And the guy, well, he's probably, he's a resident around here. Brought it in, said, never worked. Got it as a gift about a year ago. Never worked. As soon as he plugged it in, it never worked. And he said, uh, it just never worked. So, doesn't work. So, I figure I'm going to take it apart and see why it don't work. So, I'm hoping this will be an easy thing to do that I can show here on camera. Take it apart and we can see what's wrong with it. Could be the motor's already trashed or could be a lot of things actually. Why don't I have a drill? Uh, well, this is just a... I mean, why don't I have a cordless drill that can do this? I think I do. Let me go look. I'd rather use a cordless drill to take this all apart than... Ha! <laughs> corded drill. Cordless drill. <laughs> cordless drills are so much better in some ways. Okay, I think I got the screws out of the front part. There we go. There we go, I got that apart. <sighs> now what? Now, I guess we gotta get the screws out of the side. See what's wrong with this thing. I'm guessing brushes or something very wrong has gone on inside. Guy said he used it for approximately 20 seconds and then a bunch of sparks came flying out and here you go and got it as a gift so who knows what's going on inside here could have been two crossed wires could have blown up could have blew the motor up I don't know, but we're about ready to find out. So, let's hope we can figure this out. Or, maybe a wire came off. That could also be possible too. But it's a Radley drill. So, take these screws out, or can I just... Pull them up like that. My screwdriver right here. Lift up here. Lift her up. All right, what do we see? Not much. Well, <laughs> she's pretty, pretty toast right here. She's pretty toasty, as you can see. Uh, doesn't look like those. Wow, it's pretty toasty. Okay. I think. What can I do here? I don't want to do anything that's stupid now. Well, one second. Well. I got a bad feeling this thing is a little toasty -er than I was thinking it would be. So that is burnt up there really good. Let me see here. Oh yeah. Well, I see what happened. I see what happened. Both sides. Uh, one sec. Well, on both sides, the brushes disintegrated. So, the brushes are both pretty disintegrated on both sides. There's nothing really left for them. You can see there's nothing touching the, uh, what is this thing called? I forget what it's called. Darn it. 
but there is nothing on both sides touching the the thing blew up <laughs> so it's it's in all the way but it, it it can't even touch anymore so of course it's not gonna run so crap it's it's done or I can get some new brushes and I can fix it but I don't know if it'll happen again because that really toasted this pretty good and yeah I can see there's all sorts of uh, brush falling out of out of here so yeah the brushes blew up yeah she spins so nice when there's no brushes there's no brushes holding it so there we go we know what happened to it I don't have brushes for it eh, maybe I could go get some brushes for it maybe I could uh, fix it but depends these things are only like $79 I think in the store and maybe I'll see if I can find some brushes for it first and see then if I can replace them both. Clean up the, uh, what do you call that? I forget the name of it. Is that a stator? I'm not sure. Clean that up really good and uh, see if we can get it working. That would be nice. Then we'd have a nice drill for work here. Of course, I do have cordless drills here for work, so... Yeah. Who knows? <laughs> it's just electric ones seem to have more power sometimes. But uh, yeah, now we know what happened to this drill. It's kind of destroyed the brushes and they're not even touching anymore. So there you go. It's done. All right. Thanks for watching and I'll uh, bring you more uploads in the future.